Here's your Pinpoint Weather 12 forecast. Well, the relative humidity this evening, close to 100% in some areas, so that's usually a tip-off of a little bit of patchy, shallow, what we call ground fog, right near the ground overnight, early tomorrow morning. Take a look outside. Now, in Newport, visibility is pretty good. Looking at uh, increasing clouds and uh, wide range in temperature. Some spots are already in the mid-40s, other locations in the lower 50s, so it is cool, but not as frosty cold as some of the nights we've had over the weekend, so we're not talking about temperatures getting below low freezing high temps today boy pretty nice mid and upper 60s similar temperatures coming up for tomorrow afternoon so running a bit above average and the little shading of blue indicating those locations that have temps now already down into the mid 40s won't drop much further than that in Providence is still low 50s as well as Smithfield Newport's down to 48 so you take a look at the relative humidity and the moisture and you see anywhere from 90 to 100 percent so we'll introduce a little patchy fog overnight early tomorrow morning it burns off and overall it's a milder week ahead the afternoons the temperatures be running above average now we have a few showers in the forecast for tomorrow and again on Wednesday mainly during the afternoon hours especially tomorrow afternoon giving it about a 40 percent chance of some scattered showers uh, drought well obviously it continues though we made some progress last week with the rain you know the rainfall deficit since January 1st uh, initially was 10 inches now it's it's down to eight inches so obviously we have a ways to go and I think what precipitation we get tomorrow afternoon isn't very widespread. It's more of a scattered type of shower activity. Most of the steadier rain to our north and west uh, along this what we call a stationary front, this alternating red and blue line. On one side of it, uh, it is chilly, and on the other side of it, it's mild. We're on the mild side of things over the next several days. Actually, some snow across uh, the northern plains this afternoon. That is Tropical Storm Epsilon. Here's the New England coastline in Bermuda. We are still in hurricane season using the Greek alphabet. Winds of 45, potentially Potential to become a hurricane, but it will stay out in the Atlantic, though it may send back some waves here, some surf, by the end of the week and the weekend. Take a look at the big temperature contrast, the, the relatively milder air across the East Coast and the winter chill back through the upper Great Lakes. That will stay away over the next several days. Forecast overnight showing temperatures upper 40s to around 50, waking up to mostly cloudy skies tomorrow morning. We really don't see much in the way of shower activity during the morning, but notice the coverage starts to increase though by the afternoon and evening hours so best advice keep the umbrella nearby during the afternoon you won't need it the entire afternoon but every now and then you will get a shower 11 o'clock tomorrow night that's pretty mild for an October night at 11 p.m. temperatures are still in the 60s so for tomorrow morning uh, partly the mostly cloudy slight chance of a shower though the chances start to increase by late morning scattered showers at times tomorrow afternoon temperatures still running a bit above average the average high for this time of year is 60 we're forecast 67 and close to 70 on Wednesday. It's a mainly dry day, just a spotty shower. Look at Thursday and Friday, even Saturday. Temperatures in the afternoon still very mild, upper 60s to around uh, 70. So yeah, a couple of showers tomorrow afternoon. You afraid of heights? A bit, yeah. You're not going to like this story. All right, what's now. up?